All right, I'm here at the clay pit, and this is um, kind of odd. This tile here is a 37 quality tile, but every other tile around it is different, 24. So I think this should be higher quality this way, but it's only a 15. So either it was buried, and see this one is a 10, which is weird, a 34, a 10, a 37, a 10, a 15. A seven. See, it's going down. A fifteen. But it doesn't account for the thirty-seven there. It doesn't just make any sense that you have a ten. So technically speaking, this way should be a higher, a higher um, tile. Oh, thirty-five. Forty-two. Ooh, that's looking promising. So up here is probably high quality ore. Now, how am I going to get up there? Seventy-six. I'm going to dig here for our mine. And I bet if I prospect mining, prospect for iron. see what the system says you have not discovered let's do a mining iron let's do 76 tiles <laughs> bet there's iron ore I can see the discoloration of the rock up there you see that discoloration up there so you have discovered the signs so you know let's go half of that You have discovered signs. All right, let's go half of that. 22 tiles. All right, so 20 tiles. You have discovered. All right, cool. I'm getting better. Let's go. Let's go to 10 tiles. I basically want to keep digging in this direction because this here. You have discovered, right? So it's not that far away. And it's going to be pretty good quality. And it's right there. So what I'm going to do here is um, mining, right? Let's go. I was going to go get, <laughs> I was going to build my kiln. Uh, but you never know. You, you go there to do something. You go, huh, that's odd. 37? And this doesn't look right. And that. And basically that has led me here. So I'm going to go digging upward. Uh, maybe I have to dig forward here. Okay. I'm not the best miner, let me tell you. So I'm going to dig forward here. So I'm going to pause the video here. And um, I'm going to start digging this mine out. And then I'll start it and, and let you know what's going on. Thanks a lot for watching. And uh, remember, please like, follow, and consider joining our Steam group. We have um, a Steam group. It's called Life uh, Freeport uh, Merchant Co-op Cooperative, and um, basically, you can uh, launch your own Freeport. I'm actually trying to get the mice <laughs> mouse, mouse away. Um, finger, finger. I always like to do a little role role play. My beautiful Sun Tzu, um, my my kids, I'm kind of going on a tangent here, my kids asked me, Dada, Dada, why do you play a female? I said, well, this is Mama. My wife is Japanese. And unlike Mama in the real world, who doesn't do anything Dada says and gets upset when I ask her to do anything, Mama does everything Dada says in this game. If I say hop, she hops. Watch. Whoa! If I say take out a weapon, look, she'll take out a weapon, right? Take out her take out her saw, right? Hit, the, hit someone with a saw. See? Mama does everything I tell her. And she kind of looks kind of angry. That's kind of like Mama. Mama's face right there. Always looks stern and angry. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you enjoy the video. And uh, see you in Life is Feudal. Please join our Steam group. It's listed below. We're a 
cooperative. We're not a guild. Anyone can launch Freeport on their server, on their Yo server, on their MMO uh, server tile. Um, you can join us uh, on our, you know, on what we're doing. And uh, this is our official, our official um, uh, Yo game server. And I'm here basically learning myself and practicing my skills that I'll be using in the MMO. Thanks for watching.